everybody, the Black Stealth here, and today I'm going to show you how to install Format Factory for Mac. So as you can see here, it says All Windows OS. That's not going to stop us. So what you can do is you're going to download Format Factory first thing. Just click on Download right here. I'll have this link in the description. Click on this Download Now button on to the right. And then click on Download Down again, and wait a few seconds. It should start downloading. As you can see, it starts downloading starting download up there and now you're gonna go to this link in the description this is wineskin what wineskin does is it basically lets you uh, run windows programs on a mac so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna go type in wineskin to google or click on the link in the description go to downloads click right here download it and it'll start downloading in a couple seconds this one will be faster And stop. So once you have this, this over here. So once you have Wineskin downloaded, just go ahead and take it out and put it in your applications folder or desktop or wherever. I already have it in there. I'll just replace it. Double click on it. Open. And you'll get this. So what you can do is you're gonna hit this little plus right here. And you're gonna click on the top. Where it says WS9 line 1.5, oops, 1.5.8. You're gonna hit download install. It should look like this, and then hit OK. Uh, there's like a lot of waiting with this, so just be patient. I'll speed all the waiting up for you. Okay, now that it's here. It's done downloading. You're gonna make sure this is highlighted and hit update. Hit OK again. And then more wait. Okay, now that this is that's done downloading or updating, you're gonna make sure this is highlighted again and hit right here. Create new blink wrap. I can name this whatever you want. We'll just name it format. Factory, factory. Okay, okay. And more waiting. Once you get to here, just hit allow. And then right here, hit install. Uh, now this could take like a pretty long time. My internet's kind of slow, so actually it's going faster now. But it took like 20 minutes last time, so just be patient. I'll speed this up ahead. Okay, now that we're here, uh, it'll say this, just go ahead and hit install again, and more waiting. Alright, now it's created the wrapper, so just click this button right here, view wrapper and finder, and it'll go up to here, uh, ignore the Terraria one and double click on yours. You can also close out of Wineskin Winery right here. You can close out of that if you want to. And now is where you're going to go and get your FS, FF setup 296.exe or whatever it happens to be. And in Wineskin you're going to hit install software. And you're going to hit choose setup executable. And you're going to go ahead and select the file you just downloaded. Factory. Okay. Now this is the Format Factory installer installation. Uh, you're gonna hit install, and it should be fairly quick. Yeah. yeah. Alright, 
Now, if you don't want to run it, then you can uncheck that, but I just want to check. And make sure this is checked, and hit finish. Just wait a few seconds. You can't click it again. It's just it's slow. Okay, and now this is up. And there you go, here's one my pack. So uh, we're not quite done yet. Uh I'll show you I'll give you an example of converting. So I just hit right there. As you can see I hit all to MP4. And then output setting. That's MP4 actually. And then you can hit right here, add file. Now it's going to be on this. To get to your files, you're going to click this little arrow right here. And then you can go up to your name, and then I can go up to desktop, and then intro. I'll just select this, and hit OK. Now you can hit use multi threads, it might make it faster, it might not. I'll use it. Um, then you just can click, click to start, and it'll convert it. Now it'll close right af after as soon as it converts. It. Yeah, it'll do this. So I just hit close. It still converted it. If you want to see it, just go to documents, scroll down, FF output. Here it is. Actually, here, here it is, the new one. And it's just my intro instead of that move to in that MP4. So, actually, I'll show you the video. It still works fine. I don't need that. But now, if you go back to your wrapper, which is located, by the way, in your name, and then applications, wine skin, and then here it is. If you double click on it again, it comes up with this. This is not what you want. You're going to want to click on this little thing and then go all the way down here to slash program files free time format factory slash format factory dot exe just click on that and then click ok now you can hit quit and just open back up so there you go that's format factory now i haven't been able to find a way to get away or find a workaround from the crashing but it still converts your files and doesn't corrupt them so I can just convert this again. Hit OK up here. Use multi thread. Start. You can do multiple files at a time, by the way. And then it'll crash again. But at least it's still functioning perfectly, and it still converts your items. So, yeah, this was the Black Stealth. Thanks for watching.